Hi everyone and this is a short presentation that just explains a little bit with an introduction uh, about how module 4 works and the two pieces of assessment that are in module 4 which um, uh, the first one is the annotated bibliography and the second one is the Let's Go activities and research essay. So we're just going to talk a little bit here um, in an overview of how those two pieces of assessment are actually related to each other. So what we have in Module 4 is a topic that's going to um, be our guide through both those pieces of assessment and I've written this topic here on the slide. It is the Australian lifestyle has created some problems for the natural environment. Discuss two of these problems and the way they are being addressed. So that is the topic for both your annotated bibliography assignment 3 and for your research essay which is assignment 4. So both assignment 3 and assignment 4 require you to choose two problems and then, full, and then look for information about them and the ways that they're being addressed. So you will use the same two problems in both assignments and the activities in week 7 will lead you towards deciding what your two problems are that you're going to focus on. So what will happen in the annotated bibliography? You're going to look for three resources that um, seem like they might be useful research on the problems you've chosen from the topic and to do that you're going to use the information literacy skills you've acquired in preparation skills for university. So you're going to search the library and other information resources such as the internet, the Australian Bureau of Statistics if it's appropriate to your problems, uh, different government websites and we'll be looking to see how effectively you can do that and I will be doing more um, instruction about that in next week's topic in week 8. So this assignment the annotated bibliography is the beginning of the background reading and research that you need for assignment 4 to write your essay. So then in the research essay you're going to write a 1500 word academic essay in response to our topic and the resources that you find for your annotated bibliography may form part of your research and references for this essay. So in that way um, the research essay follows on from the annotated bibliography. The annotated bibliography is part of your preparation for the research essay. So what do you need to keep in mind as you start module 4? Well I've come up with five key things. The first one is don't forget the skills you've already developed in paragraph structure and in-text referencing because we're going to continue building on these as you work towards the um, assignment for the research essay. The second one is it's really important that you follow the steps on Moodle and the steps in your study guide really, really carefully because there's different things that you're going to have to complete that need handing in, not just the essay. Um, and I'll talk about them in a couple of weeks. Don't be shy about asking us questions now at this point. The research essay is your biggest piece of assessment. It's worth 50% of your marks. So if you find yourself getting stuck or having trouble, it's absolutely vital that you get in contact and ask questions um, from your lecturer, whether you're an internal student or if you're a distance student. Four, it's going to be really important that you manage your time so you keep on track and you don't get behind in the weekly activities because this was, is one assignment that you don't want to leave till the last minute. And check your email and Moodle really regularly now a couple of times a week as I'll be putting up extra resources as we move through these last um, five weeks of the course. So with all that in mind, that's just a basic introduction. We're ready to go on the journey through Module 4 together. So let's go.